28.1. Define dipole moment. Answer. Dipole moment is the product of the magnitude of charge at one end and the distance between the charges. 2. Dipole moment of BF3 is 0. Why? Answer. BF3 has planar triangular shape. Here, the resultant of any two bond dipoles is equal and opposite to the third, so its net dipole moment is zero. 3. Explain the shape and bond angle of NH3 molecule using VSEPA theory. Answer. Shape. Pyramidal. Bond angle. 107 degree. 29. 1. Define extensive and intensive properties. Give one example for each. Answer. Properties which depend on the amount of matter present in the system are called extensive properties. Example. Mass, volume, heat, capacity, enthalpy, internal energy, etc. Write in one. Properties which are independent of the amount of matter present in the system are called intensive property example temperature pressure density surface tension viscosity etc write in your one two the equilibrium constant for a reaction is five what will be the value of delta g0 answer delta g0 is equal to minus 2.303 rt log kc is equal to 2.3 303 into 8.314 into 300 into log 5. The answer is minus 4.01 kg per mole. 30. First, define ionic product of water. Answer. Ionic product of water is defined as the product of the molar concentration of hydrogen ion and hydroxyl ion in water or in any aqueous solution. 2. Give an application of common ion effect. Answer. Common ion effect found application in the purification of NaCl or common ion effect is used for almost complete precipitation of a particular ion as its springly soluble salt or examples like precipitation of silver ion as silver chloride or ferric ion as ferric hydroxide or barium ion as barium sulfate. Write any one application. 3. Calculate the pH of a 0.1 m solution of a NaOH. Answer. Here, OH minus equal 0.1 m equal 10 raised to minus 1 m. So, pOH equal minus log OH minus equal minus log 10 inverse equal 1 pH equal 14 minus pOH equal 14 minus 1 equal 13. 31. First, explain any two types of electron displacement effects in covalent bonds. Answer. Inductive effect. First effect. It is a shifting of sigma electrons through a carbon chain in the presence of an atom or a group of atom attached to it. It is a permanent effect. Electromeric effect E effect. It is the shifting of pi electrons of a multiple bond in the presence of an attacking reagent. It is a temporary effect. Resonance effect R effect. It is defined as the polarity produced in the molecule by the interaction of two pi bonds or between a pi bond and a lone pair of electrons present on an adjacent atom. Hyperconjugation. It is a permanent effect. Here, the sigma electrons of CH bond of the alkyl group enter into partial conjugation with the unsaturated system or with the unshared p orbitals. Write in two effects. 2. Name two methods used to estimate the presence of nitrogen in an organic compound. Answer Dumas method and Kildall's method.